Okay, let's get everyone to settle. Let's see how that happens. All right, are we ready? What would you want to tell someone about being here? That we exist. <laughs> <laughs> I've worked in Silicon Valley for over a dozen years, and I fell in love with the ability to build products that people use that really help uh, help them in their day-to-day -day lives. I don't think anybody ever gets into software thinking that they're like not going to change the world, but are we really tackling the like most important problems? So I have a kid, and there's a lot of things going on in the world that make me a little bit afraid for his future. For all the issues I cared about, mental health and education, I could see tech being a powerful tool in my favor to affect change. CZI is like where we combine technology with philanthropy, right? So it's very unique. We are tackling a, a couple of really big problems. How do you educate each child in a way that is personalized and unique to them? How can we cure, prevent, or manage all disease? How can we build a world that is just and full of opportunity? So I went to a conference for biologists and met a woman uh, who was a researcher in Nigeria. And when we explained some of the tools that we were building, like Meta and the Human Cell Atlas data coordination platform, she was so excited that a technology philanthropy was paying attention to these needs. She, quote, said it was democratizing science. I've talked with several parents of kids who have dyslexia just like I do, and their hearts, it seems like, have been so warmed by seeing their child being able to learn at their own pace, being able to learn the material in a way that they no longer feel self-conscious. Our goal is to bring engineering to important social problems, to build useful tools and solutions that can scale to meet the needs of many. I had no idea that a job like this existed. I got almost like goosebumps. I was like, yes, I can do all of these things. I just feel so at home. It was really the best thing that I possibly could have imagined, and I'm super happy that it's my first job. If you see what these goals are and like what the world would look like if they really achieved everything, that's really important to me. It is a better world for everyone, and I really wanted to be a part of that.